there were four people around the club. The player manager, Norman Dodgin, the trainer come physiotherapist, Harry Hanford, the secretary, George Gilbert, and the groundsman, Sonny Clark. Nobody else had anything to do with the running of the club. The directors, which were all lovely local businessmen, but they weren't hands on. They were, they were ex players and they were local businessmen, but they didn't have anything to do with running the club. We never really saw them except on match days. So, four people run the club. George Gilbert did everything from banking the takings. You get 9,000 people coming through, mainly through the turnstiles. Somebody had to count the cash and bank it every whole match. He did all the wages, tax, NI, paid all the wages, had to put it all in. We were all paid in cash. That money had to be put into little brown envelopes on a Friday. He had arranged for all the ticket sales. He had arranged for over, um, the travel, over, you know, travel away. He had to do all that. Nobody, nobody ever helped him. If you went in to get your wage on a Friday morning, somebody shout, wages are up, so the players would make their way down to the George's office. You'd go in, he'd hand you your brown envelope and you'd have to sign a sheet that you'd had your wages. There'd be a knock on the door and there was this little sliding hatch. And there'd be somebody there and they'd say, yeah, oh, I'll have two stand tickets and one for the enclosure. And he'd say, hang on lads, and he'd stop paying the players and he'd go over and serve the guy at the hatch. And you'd think, well, how does he do all this? You know, he was a bloke in his 60s, I think. Amazing that somebody like that was doing all this administrative work for the club. Because all the manager did was look after the teams. Uh, he didn't do anything with the training of the teams. Harry Hanford was the trainer. He had to look after all the kit, get it washed, get it back, clean it, hang it out on <laughs> match days. Um, Harry Hanford had to do all that. Uh, amazing, really.